Welcome everyone, welcome to this under investigation video. Today we're looking at protest number 9 of the current season. Uh, this incident happened in the GT3 Fixed series. So there's kind of two incidents right uh, that I'm going to take a look at. Uh, a bit of a mess to be honest uh, on lap 5. So we're going to make sure that we cover all the angles for the stewards. So the first part of the incident is this contact right there between the Porsche and uh, number 22 or position 22 of this Ferrari and uh, what happened afterwards. <coughs> I'm sorry. All right. Um, so for this one, I mean, I don't need much um, angles. So a shallower approach from the Ferrari at the back <coughs> uh, tack tackles the bumper, rear bumper of the Porsche. So I just want to make sure that we have uh, contact and it's not a uh, netcode. So of course, in this case, um, it's not a matter of corner rights. Of course, uh, the Porsche has already started turning in. Uh, we're approaching the apex. It's just a matter of uh, managing uh, car distance and in this case uh, there is definite contact right there right here all right uh, that spins the Porsche around And a full contact. All right. So a bit of a opportunistic move from Joseph at the back. There was some space until there wasn't. So of course when you see an incident in front of you, in general, um, you want to keep driving safe. Uh, at PRL we don't want drivers trying to take opportunity of uh, incidents in front and staying flat out and tend to more go on their realistic uh, option which would be probably slowing down. Uh, taking evasive actions. The top view will help to see what was each car uh, trajectory. So of course it's a three wide. Uh, it's always a, a tough one. I'm gonna keep the <coughs> the telemetry on for the Porsche see what's going on so we're turning right of course the track that's where the track goes uh, there's a, also a car to the left so not, not much space to go car to the left and then just right next to it so there's only one possibility here <coughs> so let's take a look from the Ferrari cockpit view, maybe from the start. So, see the spin. For it and kind of lost a couple of position. So, the Audi in front, very safe. Wait, this one has been cleared. Uh, this Ferrari there. First, gonna receive the car in front of the face. Then, nothing really he could do. Again, kind of a passenger for this one. And from the Ferrari. Uh, 
All right. Um, so, of course, from my perspective, and I'm going to submit this to the stewards anyways. Um, so the first contact here, pretty straightforward. I mean, no overlap, um, no corner rights whatsoever. A bit of a contact, pretty pretty straightforward. Um, for the second part of the incident, it's not so clear that the Audi on the inside was reckless. It's not very 100% safe as well. Going three wide, there was uh, an opportunity at some point, but was still three wide. So I'm gonna take it with uh, with the team, take this with the team, and uh, make our decision public in the Discord channel. So have a nice day, everyone. Stay safe out there.